Hello, and welcome to Drawing with Mr. B. I'm Mr. B, and that is Bubbles from the Powerpuff Girls. So, uh, <laughs> this looks like uh, it could be a fun thing to draw. Well, you've come to the right place. I picked this pose especially because I liked her, uh, her fighting, punching upward thing. It's very action. I don't know. It seemed, even though, you know, Bubbles is usually pretty bubbly, I, I still did like this. All right, so. If you want to do it, just stay tuned and we're going to draw it in this episode here. All right, so for our drawing of bubbles, I wanted a really dynamic pose. So uh, as you just saw, she's flying with her fist up in the air. Um, it does make it slightly harder to draw. So what we're going to do is we're actually going to draw that arm coming across her face first, and then we can do the other details. So let's start right about here. We go up, 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 all the way around and back down like that. Awesome. Now, just like with um, the video of uh, Blossom from the other day, we're going to build her head from the outside in just for the ease of it. So let's start right about here. We're going to go out and around. Right about to there, and we'll stop. Set up again on the other side of the arm. And connect it back up like that. And again, just like last time we did a Pop Puff Girls, we we'll start with the bangs or the hair. So we'll have a curving line going out this way to the edge. Oops, and then another curving line going out this way to there. All right. Now, let's do, we're gonna do it slightly differently. Again, we'll do the brow, and then once we're done with that line, we'll make the eye. So she's got a furrowed brow, right? So we're gonna go like this, and up to there. Same thing on this side, down and around, and up until we hit the hairline. All right, now, starting about here, we're gonna make a curving line goes down right to the edge, like so. Same thing. Start about here. No. Here on the line. Curve it down till I get to there. Curve it around the other side, like so. All right. Now, let's do pupils irises, etc. So we'll start here again. We're going to go out, around, and back in. Another further out curve, like so. And another even further out line, like so. Same thing over here, although it's going to be partially blocked by her hand, her arm, so we're going to go like that. And then, like that. And finally, the outer part, the iris. Oops. Just missed that, huh? Didn't I? Okay. Oh. Connect it back there. Connect it back there. Ooh, that line is a little off. But let's try that one one more time. Awesome. Okay. Now, mouth. We'll start in the corner of her mouth. And it's going to be pretty flat on the bottom. And it curves quite a bit around the top, back down to where we started. Do a couple lines to indicate her teeth. She's creating her teeth like a kind of grrr face. There. All right, let's do her uh, pigtails. So we'll start about here. Can go out? And around to a point, come back in like so. Same thing on the side, out and around, and come back in like so. Just missed it there. Okay. Now, now we can continue with her body. So, connect it like that. So, we'll start here with this line, and we're going to continue it down all the way to her foot all the way through her leg. So here we go. So 
right here. We're just going to go down, 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 around, and back up until we get to about there. Let's do her other leg, which is bent at the knee. Come down, 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 around, and back up. Let's do this side of her body. So coming out from her chin, a curve, short curve line like so. And then her arm, out and around, down like that. Okay, let's do some interior details here. So, so we're gonna do uh, a line across here for her belt of her dress, like so. And then the, the, the bottom of the dress is gonna cross, come across like this. So it is gonna be blocked by the leg somewhat. All right, and then right about here, this is where her dress ends and her sock begins, or maybe tights. Um, and then we're gonna have a line that is her shoe. The line's gonna go across here. They all kind of have like ballet shoes, I've noticed, like so. And then because her shoe is here, the line at the bottom gets more kind of bold. So let's do like a curve down, around, and up like so. Let's do some of those same details here. So right where that line came across, we can have her top of her shoe start here, curve across. And it's gonna be a little bit more curved on that foot, a little more obviously curved. And down, and around, and up. And yeah, that is our blossom. I'm just looking to see if there are, I'm sorry, I just called her blossom. That is our bubbles. The leader, or no, not the leader. Blossom is leader. Bubbles is the joy and laughter. Gosh, it's been a long time since I've actually sat down and watched this show, but I remember that outro theme song <laughs> pretty well. All right, so I'm going to clean up Bubbles, and then we'll finish this video. And there she is, friends. Bubbles, all colored and cleaned up and looking about how I wanted her to look. So, cool beans. Awesome. If you like this, this is my second uh, in the series on Powerpuff Girls. Keep tuning into this channel all week and you'll see more. If you're watching this after the fact, just go to that channel and you can see the rest of them. I'm going to do also, obviously, Buttercup and Mojo Jojo and more. So uh, the logo for that channel, my channel, Drawing with Mr. B, should be up on the screen now. Click on that to subscribe. Ring the bell and it'll notify you when I put out new videos, which is about five times a week. Also, you can hit the like button if you enjoyed this. And in the comments, you can tell me what you thought or you can suggest other characters for me to draw. All right, until next time, friends, I'll see you later.